So, Prayer View is going to start out with Labor Day Classic, as always. And it's in Houston this year. Right. So, it's in Houston this year at the at the soccer field. Right. Uh, they got Abilene Christian. Uh, I think they're playing them in Abilene. Uh, no, they're not playing them in Abilene. No. They're playing them in uh, Prayer View. Uh-huh. And then they play SMU. Ah, that's in Dallas, right? That's in Dallas. Yes. I will go see that game. At least they get to stay in Texas. Yeah, they get a chance. Yeah, I just, Lord, they get to stay just in hope Texas that nobody gets week. hurt up. We hope the players don't get hurt up. I think they got uh, Houston Christian later that year. Yeah, they too, do. Or this they year do. Too. Yeah. They do. October 14th. Yeah, so they and got this? two out of conference games in the FCS. Yeah. So, Abilene Christian, SMU, and Houston Christian. Uh -huh. That's yeah. Free, ain't it? No, well, SMU's uh, FBS. Oh, okay. Group of five. They're so, in the uh, AAC. Yeah, in the AAC. So, yeah, that schedule looks, I don't want to say brutal, but you, you're going to test your metal when, when you play yeah. this schedule. Yeah, right they are. They are. Uh, go to. Uh, all corn. They got a hell of a schedule. Shout out to oh, Fred yeah. McNair. He ain't. He's not ducking any smoke, man. He mm -hmm. he wants to play everybody. Never had oh, okay. yeah. I see that schedule. I was like, ooh, ooh. I love back. it. I, love, just, I absolutely I'll, love it. I'll make that two-hour drive down to East Texas just to go see that game. I don't care about that. I want to go see the game. <laughs> they better beat. Let me say this. Uh, any all corn people listening. You, you, you better get you better get your lick back against Stephen F. Austin. You let them walk out of Lorman with a with a free win that you handed them on a on a platter. I need them to beat Stephen F. Austin, and they lost all their good talent from that team. And Alcorn should go into Stephen F. Austin and win that road game. Yeah, they got they got um, first game of the season against Southern Miss. They got Stephen F. Austin. And then you got make me state. So you pretty much running it back what you had from last season, except for yeah. that. Yeah. That's all you yeah, doing. Yeah, they just yeah. Yeah, they flipped the home and homes, like because all, all it was was them finishing out their contracts. Right. Mm -hmm. And they drew Alabama State on the road, which is a tough, you know, cross division game. because it's tough to go play in Montgomery, man. You say what you want, but I mean, listen, that 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 stadium's legit. Yeah. Oh no, but but even with even just playing in that stadium, just Alabama State period, defensive wise, they they play with you know they play with some nastiness to them. Yes, like, they do. That's Florida and them last year. <laughs> That's Florida they play, and them. They play with some nastiness too, and then yeah. Alabama State still got uh, as far as the defensive backfield, they pretty much still. Yeah. Intact. Oh yeah. And I think Adrian Matt is going to get better. Uh, yeah. Who's on the other they side? Got a, um, they, they brought in a fresh. Oh man, I forgot his name. They brought in a freshman. Uh, I can't. I'm blanking on his name now. But Is they Bubba also back? brought in. I, yes, Bubba's back, and they yeah. also got a new quarterback. They also got a new quarterback coach. Who? Who, Who? Did they get? Uh, they, they got uh, Patrick Browning. He was the head coach over at Pike Road. He uh, led them to the five A state championship in Alabama. Uh, this in, did he in play call? Hopefully, he do the play calling. Yeah, he did. <laughs> and, yeah, and and they won twenty nine straight regular season games in his final three years as a head coach. Wow! But well, why he not the offense coordinator? Um, they they kept uh Henry Miller as OC, but Browning will be working one on one with Demetrius Davis. Good, I'm, man. That's that's good news, Blue. That's good news. He uh uh Browning all. Browning coached in the SWAC already. He was the QB coach at Prairie View in 2014 when they had a, a Lovelock as the quarterback. Right, I oh, remember yeah. him. Yeah, I remember. Him. Yeah, yeah. So he's he's been in the SWAC before. He was killing it at Pike Road. Pike, you know, I, I live in Alabama, man. They they were one of the top. Uh, Pike Roads were the kid that uh, the running back at Ole Miss who won the uh, the Conley Award. He came right. to Pike Road. 
Oh, yeah, you mean that freshman they had this year? Yes, yes. Yeah, he was that guy, yeah, that kid was good. Yeah, I remember him. Yeah, Juggins. I, I think yeah, was yeah, there. I remember. Yeah, he was something else. Uh, yeah, but that's that's their that's their new QB coach. But man, guys, I gotta I gotta run out of here. I gotta go get yeah, dinner. Yeah. And, and, thank and you, Blue. Late, but, hey, for, hey, thank you, pre- Blue. Pre- appreciate y'all. Y'all have a good All night. Right, have a good night, Blue. Thank you, man. That's the, that's the FCS encyclopedia right there. Anything oh yeah. No. We got our, oh, swag, our our HBCU encyclopedia, Mr. Ford, and then <laughs> Blue. That is the FCS. If you want to know anything, even FBS, he is a book. Uh, go to um, let's see, go to Texas Southern because I want to see what they schedule like again, man. Because having having Link California on their schedule again. Or they homecoming again. Ain't this is the, awful. <laughs> ain't the best <laughs> thing in the head. See, I remember <laughs> time when your homecoming opponent was a big time game. That was a big game. That wasn't no cupcake. Oh, they 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 um scheduled Lincoln too. That's Ooh. awful. They sketched Texas Southern. God, That's Lincoln. not fair to the fans. It's not fair to the fans. They're going to be at, and, and then they play their game at Alexander Durley Stadium, too. Over oh, that's on campus. That's on oh. campus. So it's really not a big game. So, like, if it was a big game, that'd be, that that thing would have been over at the, <laughs> at the soccer field. At the soccer, at the soccer field. field. So they got preview. Ooh, they go to Toledo. So they'll be in, they go to Toledo, Ohio. Mm-hmm. Uh, play Rice over, which ain't number down the street to them. Right, over the right stadium. Uh, so you got Grambling and then, um, mm, Grambling Lincoln. comes to them. Grambling, no, they go to Grambling, they go to Grambling, okay. yeah, okay. they go to Grambling. So that'll uh, tell us something about both of them. But then, you got, yeah, we need to more. see, we need to see all the glitz and glamour. Now, we want to see what. It, we do all of this extra with the recruiting classes and yeah. The cars and the yep. Louis luggage. We want to oh, see. Yeah. yeah, the makeup. Now I would say this. Fam, you coming to, to, to Houston to play Texas Southern October 21st? That's gonna be big. That's be big. They That's gonna be big. To out that stadium for fam you. If you if you did it for Jackson, do it for fam you too. That's gonna and, be and big listen, team. fam you has a lot of alarms in Houston. They have a lot of them. It's a lot of people from uh, that are family graduates in Houston, Texas. Emmett Jones said every school is starting off one and two. Who? <laughs> Who? Not Jackson State. So there you got. Go so down. Keep going down. You got. They got Southern and Baton Rouge. Oh, that's a biggie. That's a biggie. Um, they, they go to. They go to Baton Rouge. Go to Baton Rouge. Oh, that's gonna be a big game. Uh, Jackson State. November the fourth, so that's in Jackson. Okay, they and, they, and, they come to Jackson. Uh huh. What's the last game on the bottom? Let me scroll down a little bit. Okay. Yeah. All corn oh. and Pine Bluff. So they had the last two games at home. Texas Southern has a two-game win streak against Southern, right? Yes. But it's in it's in month for stadium, you know, the Southern Stadium. Hey, thank you for tuning in to She Loves The. So what did you think? Too much? Not enough? Yeah. Need more facts? Yeah. What other topics do you think I should cover? Yeah. Comment below and don't forget to like and subscribe. Yeah, 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 yeah. The, I love. Yeah.